third Monday of February, which means it is President's Day. And even though the kids are off from school right now, we're going to go to school. All okay. right, here's the yes. deal. The holiday honors the 45 people who have ever been president. Now Grover Cleveland served twice. George Washington died in 1799 and his birthday is February 22nd. It became a day of remembrance. By 1855, the whole country celebrated it as a federal holiday. Abraham Lincoln's birthday is February 12th. And in 1971, the Uniform Monday Holiday Act went into effect, moving a number of federal holidays to Mondays. And that established President's Day as one that we all celebrate our commanders in chief. Now, the question still remains, is it an apostrophe or no apostrophe? It's the big debate here on the eye opener. And according to the Associated Press style book, which we follow, there is no apostrophe in President's Day. Hmm. It's officially referred to by the U.S. government as Washington's plural <laughs> possessive birthday, even though it's not always on February 22nd. Singular possessive. Singular, singular yeah, possessive. Yes, right. Wash, wash. Right, right. The right. teachers are watching. We know That's the right. teachers well, are we watching. But, sure you know, teacher right. Donna Falsey says there is an apostrophe. The AP book is what we're just going to go by. Whatever the MB.